Besides size, a second trend that we can get from the periodic table is called the ionization energy. Basically, if you take an atom and you add enough energy to it, you can remove an electron. And if you take away an electron, the atom will turn into a cation. The key thing for ionization energy is the larger the atom, the electron that we're removing will be farther away from the nucleus and that is easier to remove and so a larger atom has a smaller ionization energy. So in other words, the trend is the opposite of the size trend. If you sketch out a rectangle for a periodic table, the ionization energy will get bigger exactly the opposite of the size. So towards the top and towards the right. So again, say I give you three elements, boron, oxygen, and aluminum, and ask you which of those has the smallest ionization energy and which would have the largest ionization energy. You remember this trend, you make a quick, quick sketch of that, and then find these elements on the periodic table. So boron is about here, oxygen, and aluminum. So out of these, the largest ionization energy is farthest up and farthest to the right, so that would be oxygen. And the smallest ionization energy would be in the opposite corner, which would be aluminum.